Proud of all of our dispatchers. Um, we know this is very hard on them and their families as we're talking about their, their long-term jobs here. Uh, the future of Perry County's 911 dispatch is unknown as the Board of Commissioners considers outsourcing the service. Good evening, everyone. The county currently operates dispatch centers out of the Sheriff's Department and the Perryville Police Department, but that could change. Madison Stewart's live in the studio with more details. Jeff, Perry County's presiding commissioner tells me outsourcing 911 dispatch would save taxpayers money. However, some people have concerns. Part of the uh, new Perry County Justice Center was to consolidate our two dispatch centers into one. Uh, they'd be housed in the new building. Uh, they are currently looking at other options to be more efficient, um, and that would be part of that outsour outsourcing plan. That outsourcing plan would mean 911 calls from Perry County would be handled in St. Francis County. Perry County Sheriff Jason Kloss says this idea raises some concerns among law enforcement. Us from the, the patrol standpoint, just not knowing our dispatchers, uh, and then also from the citizen standpoint of them calling uh, a center a couple of counties away and not really familiar with our, with our landmarks. Mike Sauer is Perry County's presiding commissioner. It's our jobs to look at budget and see where we can save taxpayers money. He says the outsourcing plan would do just that. The cost savings we are looking at is upwards of $700,000 per year. While Sauer says he understands the concerns law enforcement has, he's been assured the quality of work will remain the same. They will use the same tactics as we're using now and make sure that every officer is protected. Anyone that's out on a call will, will have backup if needed. Another concern is the loss of local jobs. The other side is our personnel. Uh, we, we have great dispatchers that work both here and at City of Perryville and, and their jobs and, the, and those concerns for their families. Sauer says the city plans to work to place those dispatchers in other positions if the plan moves forward. Majority of these employees will be absorbed into other jobs if they so choose to be there. And Sheriff Kloss says this decision is an important one. And we take that very seriously. As a sheriff, I know the police chief as well. Uh, these are conversations we have every day. Sauer says the Board of Commissioners plans to make the decision in the next couple of weeks. In the studio, Madison Stewart, Heartland News.